ladies and gentlemen, I am just walking on this glorious Jaywick Beach on this glorious Saturday afternoon. And I bumped into the lovely Ross that was blessing me and she wants got something she wants to share with me and all of you. So let me hand you over to Ross. How are you? I'm good, enjoying, enjoying this beautiful day. You look wonderful as always. Oh, thank you. And thanks for letting me film you because you've got an important message for us all to hear now. Can you please share it with my fans, my friends, my world? Yeah, I would just like to share my testimony of how, how God has yeah, changed me. my life. And I had depression for 10 years. I was on anxiety medication for seven years. There's something to and, come over. Yeah, and I was suicidal for all of those, um, like for 10 years, of my last 10 years of drinking, I was suicidal. And I always said I would never try and commit suicide. How, how long was you drinking for in total? Uh, 20 years. From, wow. Uh, from 20 until 40, I had a drink problem. So that actually killed you? Yeah, yeah. And then um, my life was so dark, so unbearable, I did try to commit suicide. And my mum found me and brought me to hospital. But even after that, I still went out drinking. I couldn't stop drinking. If I didn't drink, my body would start shaking. Yeah? Terrible. And then the day came when I just I had a nervous breakdown. I just fell on my knees and I cried out to God, please help me, please help me. And that was that was the first time that God reached out to me. And I've been sober now 15 years. Yeah? Wow. But what happened then? So after coming off the medication, I wasn't depressed anymore. Yeah. I didn't have anxiety. Yeah. But then I got busy with my life and I forgot about God. And then I went back out and I started like sleeping around. I was, I wasn't drinking, but I was sleeping around. I was swearing. I yep. was, you know, I was into all new age. Let me warn you against all new age stuff. Yep. Yoga, meditation, crystals, sh chakra balancing, tarot cards. They're all demonic. Okay. Do your research. I've done my research. Believe me. And I got involved in the new age deception. It's a deception and it will keep you away from God. So I, when my mum died then I fell into a deep depression and I ended up in my bedroom for two years and I didn't want to go out. I had no friends. I didn't talk to anyone. I just stayed in my room for two years and after two years I thought this is crazy. I've got to go out there. I've got to start living again. Yeah. So I started going out and I started doing yoga again. Shan chakra balancing. I did all the wrong things again. Yeah. Right. But I was looking for God. I was saying, God, where are you? I need you. Where yeah. are you? You thought doing that would get you there. Yes, off. I did. But, but it's it, all a lie. But it was slowing you down. Yeah. It, it blocks us. It keeps us away from the true living God. Yeah. So what's the real way to get so there? So then, so then, when I found out that all yoga, meditation, when I found out it was all demonic, I broke down in my room again and I cried. I said, God, yep. I cannot do this. I need yoga. I mean, how can I live without yoga? I need, I need help. Yeah. That evening movie came up on my YouTube feed and it was called The Last Reformation, The Beginning. Watch it. Okay. I watched the movie and at the end of the documentary, I rang them up and I said, I've just seen your movie on YouTube. I want my life like your movie. What do I have to do? They said, do you want to give your life to Jesus? I went, yes, I'm looking for God. I want a relationship with God. Yep. So they said, come here, we'll baptize you. You'll be filled with the Holy Spirit and then God will use you for miracles. He will, he will fix you up. He'll put you out in the broken world and he'll use you to help other people. And that's exactly what he does now, yeah? I don't have depression or anxiety now, nothing. Just by overcoming them things that you felt yeah. were the way to get there. And so what's the message? So my message Yeah, is, what is the message? Here's the message. If you're if you're feeling broken, depressed, if you're very sick, if you're if you feel empty, if you feel that you're never you're you're never filled with joy, if you're always searching for something, I'm telling you the answer is God. All you have to do is this. Tonight, get on your knees and say, God, I've made a mess of my life. I believe that Jesus is the Son of God, and I want to give my life to Jesus. Jesus died on the cross, and he rose again, and he is alive now. And if you just stop doing what you're doing, stop all, just turn back to God. Yeah, just turn back and say, God, please come and get me. I cannot do this. Please come and get me. Fix me. God will answer your prayer, but you first got to cry out to him. God is not going to force himself gotcha. onto us. We have to say, God, I've made a mess. Please come and get me. That's what I did. And he's completely changed my life. Yeah. Thank you for that. So basically, yeah. you just showed us all how we can give up alcohol for 20 years yeah, and, yeah. How, and how you did it. Yeah, just cry out to God. I would like to one day maybe make more videos of you to help people even further. But yeah. this will do for today. Yeah. Amen. So basically, the answer is God. God, he, the God. answer is God. Yes. And we just heard it, a testament from a woman. You just heard it all. Yes. Ross, thank you. Oh, thank you so much. And your friends shine on. This is Maxine. Hello, Maxine, shine on. <laughs> and I'll come back to you another day. And thank you for your message. All right, great to see you. And, look, and what is the name of the video? All you need is... The Last Reformation, The Beginning. It's on YouTube.